I don't know if you guys can see my old job, my old type, my old career, right? Driving a truck. Fuck that career, dude. You know, shout out to all the guys that are doing it, but I feel your pain. I know you guys want to get the fuck out of there. Work, work on having your own business. Work on having your own business because at, every time I see a truck like this, I thank God and the heavenly stars that I am no longer in that career, ladies and gentlemen. So, real quick, man. I was listening to a multi-billionaire guy. His name, he, you brought, you probably heard of him. You probably not. You know, he's like one of the very low-key guys. His name is uh, Ed Milet, right? And he was, he was saying some profound shit. And I want to ask you guys this. He said, "Desperation breeds uh, hunger." And he said a lot of times when entrepreneurs are doing really, really good in their life, they begin to lose that ambition. They begin to lose that hunger. You know, they become very comfortable. They're like, they don't want to rock the boat too much. And desperation was that, that driving force that kept you hungry. Do you guys agree with that? Do you guys agree that desperation is a driving force for you to stay hungry and ambitious in your endeavors? Now, I could tell you from my experience that when I was in a very desperate situation, either I'm about to be homeless or I don't have uh, much food to eat or anything like that, some remarkable shit happened. You know what I mean? Like I went all out. Whatever the case was, I went all out and next thing you know, I, I look up and boom, I'm in this totally different environment, totally different situation uh, financially and, and, and shit like that. It was a very, very uncomfortable feeling that I, I personally wanted to run away from. But as I listened to that podcast with Ed Milet saying that desperation was the driving force to him being hungry, staying hungry and ambitious in his endeavors, who, by the way, this guy's a multi-billionaire, private jet, you name it, he's doing this thing. And I said, God damn, you know, have I been running from the very thing that has been keeping me ambitious, keeping me hungry, keeping me focused on what I need to do? And